Hey guys, this is Amrin guys. So in this tutorial, we are going to set up Visual Studio for Mac. So let us type Visual Studio for Mac and then press enter. According to roadmap of Visual Studio 2019, we'll get Visual Studio 2017 for Mac right now and later it will be incremented to 2019. I really recommend you to use Comity Edition for 2017 for Mac because it is a featured one that are basically required for individual developers. Now, after it gets downloaded, let's install our Visual Studio for Mac. Now, let us click on that. We need to open it. Now, after some authentication, then it will prompt to Xcode page. That is, if you don't have any Xcode, then it will let you to download that Xcode. Pause the recording so that we could save some time. After downloading it, you don't need to open it. After that, you will be prompt to another console. Right now, we are able to make applications for Android, iOS, Mac OS, and .NET Core applications using tools Xamarin, Workbook, and Inspector. And later, it may be incremented to more tools as well as more platforms. Now, after some authentication, that is our MacBook username as well as password. I have to add my password over here. And then click on OK. Visual Studio for Mac ID will ask you two or three times your ID as well as passport. After downloading and installing Visual Studio, you will get your Visual Studio for Mac inside your launch pad. We are ready to open Xamarin application inside Visual Studio for Mac. Let us create a new project and then select blank form application and then click on next. You can give any name as you like. Here we are going to target two platforms that is Android as well as iOS then create it you need to give another name here I am giving new application one then let us create a new project now let us wait for some time so that our resources are loaded up now we are ready to start our Android project let us wait for some time so that our emulators get booted That's all. This is our Xamarin Forms blank Android project. Now we are ready to start our Xamarin Forms iOS project. Right click on iOS project and select set as startup project and then run it. You can select any emulator as you can from there. Now let's wait for some time. This is our Xamarin Forms iOS project. That's all. Now, now, if you want to connect your Visual Studio Mac IDE with Visual Studio for Windows IDE, then you have to go to setting option and then you have to select remote login and then we'll be using this IP address inside our Visual Studio for Windows IDE so that we could connect our whole Visual Studio for Windows IDE with our Mac so that we could share our Mac emulators with Windows for building Xamarin iOS project.